Join me as I dive into Charlie Chaplin's secret techniques and try to turn my own chaotic day into some comedy gold. Charlie Chaplin, a name synonymous with comedy, a pioneer who single-handedly transformed the world of silent cinema, and an icon who continues to inspire generations of comedians and filmmakers alike. But what made Chaplin's comedy so unique, so timeless? It's his uncanny ability to turn chaos into laughter, to weave complex emotions into a rich tapestry of humor, and to make us laugh even in the most mundane of situations. Chaplin's rise to fame was nothing short of meteoric, with his Little Tramp character becoming an instant hit with audiences worldwide. And yet, behind the scenes, Chaplin was a perfectionist, pouring his heart and soul into every detail of his films. He was a master of his craft, and his dedication to creating something truly original and innovative is what sets him apart from his contemporaries. But what's fascinating about Chaplin's comedy is its universality. It transcends language barriers, cultural divides, and even the passage of time. His films continue to delight audiences today, and that's a testament to the power of his unique style. So, what's the secret to Chaplin's success? How did he manage to turn chaos into comedy gold? Finding humor in difficult situations is a delicate art. It requires a deep understanding of human emotions, a keen observer's eye, and a willingness to take risks. Chaplin's work embodies this struggle, and his films often walk a tightrope between tragedy and comedy. Think about it. Some of his most iconic scenes are set against the backdrop of poverty, loneliness, and desperation. And yet, he manages to extract humor from these situations, not by trivializing them, but by finding the absurdity in them. Take, for instance, a scene from The Gold Rush. Chaplin's character, the little tramp, is stuck in a cabin with a fellow prospector, and they're both on the brink of starvation. In a moment of desperation, they resort to boiling and eating a leather shoe. It's a poignant scene, one that highlights the struggles of living on the fringes of society. And yet, Chaplin injects it with a dash of humor, making it both poignant and ridiculous at the same time. Chaplin's ability to find humor in difficult situations is rooted in his own life experiences. Growing up in poverty, he knew what it meant to struggle, to face rejection, and to feel like an outsider. And it's this empathy that gives his comedy its edge, its authenticity. He doesn't shy away from portraying the harsh realities of life, but he does it in a way that's both relatable and entertaining. But what about when life gets really tough? When the chips are down and all seems lost? That's when Chaplin's techniques come into play. He uses physical comedy to diffuse tension, timing to create a sense of surprise, and character development to make us care about the characters. It's a delicate balancing act, one that requires precision, creativity, and a deep understanding of what makes us laugh. Physical comedy is a staple of Chaplin's style. He was a master of the pratfall, the slip, and the tumble. But it's not just about the physicality of it all, it's about the way he uses his body to convey emotion. Watch him walk into a lamppost or try to squeeze into a tiny doorway. It's not just a gag, it's a way of expressing frustration, anxiety, and even sadness. Timing is everything in comedy, and Chaplin was a master of it. He knew exactly when to pause, when to accelerate, and when to freeze. It's all about building anticipation, creating suspense, and then subverting our expectations. Take, for instance, the scene from City Lights, where Chaplin's character is trying to escape a policeman. The way he weaves in and out of lampposts, dodges pedestrians, and leaps over obstacles is a masterclass in comedic timing. Character development is crucial to Chaplin's comedy. We care about the little tramp because we see ourselves in him. He's a lovable loser, a nobody who's trying to make a name for himself in a cruel and unforgiving world. We root for him because we want him to succeed, because we want to believe that even the most marginal of characters can find happiness. And that's what makes Chaplin's comedy so enduring. It's not just about the jokes, it's about the people behind them. One of Chaplin's most iconic scenes is from modern times, where his character struggles to keep up with the assembly line at a factory. It's a powerful commentary on the dehumanizing effects of industrialization, 
but it's also a masterclass in comedic acting. Watch the way Chaplin's body language changes as he becomes more and more frustrated, the way his eyes dart back and forth, and the way his mouth twists into a mixture of desperation and determination. What Chaplin's work teaches us is that comedy is not just about making us laugh, it's about making us feel. It's about tapping into our shared human experiences, our fears, our hopes, and our desires. And it's this ability to find humor in the darkest of times that makes his comedy so timeless, so universal. So what can we learn from Chaplin's approach to comedy? For one, we can learn to find the humor in our own chaotic lives. We can learn to laugh at ourselves, to see the absurdity in our own struggles, and to find the beauty in the mundane. And that's what makes Chaplin's work so inspiring. It's not just a collection of funny films. It's a way of living, a way of seeing the world through a prism of humor and humanity. Thanks for joining me on this journey into Chaplin's world of comedy gold. If you've got a favorite Chaplin moment, please share it with me in the comments below. And don't forget to check out my other videos on comedy legends.